Okay, here at JFK, just finished coming in from Frankfurt, Germany. We are parked at the gate. I am off duty. <laughs> so we had some follow-up questions about these thrust levers here. This Airbus, it's a 330-200. It's a shorter version than the 900 or the 300s. And we talked last time about the detents, the climb detent right there, CL, the flex max continuous, and the toga, take off or go around detent right there but we had some questions about reverse thrust obviously the engines are off engines are off we are parked at the gate um, so that's how you get forward thrust by moving these forward into the detents and yes we can in manual thrust we can use this here and we can actually move the thrust levers up to the climb detent other than that they're they're basically detented above that so yeah, we can fly an approach with manual thrust and just control them like a conventional airplane right there. Uh, so the other thing is the reverse thrust, it's right here. You just pull these up, it's idle. And then this is max reverse thrust. That's how we do it on land. That's the loud noise you hear. And then at 80 knots, we start stowing them. And then we fully stow them by the time we're below 80 knots. And that's the reverse thrust and thrust levers on the Airbus 330.